we have to be very good at certain things. So let me tell you something. There's a couple things that you need to be very good at now. So when you get older, you'll be uh, ready to do anything in life, be it a firefighter or a police officer or teacher, is reading. We have to be very good readers. So when your teachers are telling you that, you know, as far as you have to be do your homework or pay attention, you have to be a very good reader to be a firefighter. You have to be a very good listener to be a firefighter. So we, we always are constantly, so whatever it might be, listening to where we have to go or listening to people tell us what's wrong with them, you have to be a very, very good listener. Our very first unit of the year was really all about government and local government and the departments that make up our local government and so we did a lot of study into that and um, we talked about taxes and how they pay for all these different departments and we looked into each one so this was really now to dive in and get an even deeper uh, experience with all of our different departments. We already had our resource officer, Officer McDuffie, come in and he talked from a police perspective and so now we had the fire chief come in today and talk to us in our classrooms and then we were able to get a tour of the fire trucks out here just so they could see what are the responsibilities um, of each one of the workers, um, what are the different vehicles and things that they drive, um, who they work with and what they do within our, within our community. So I wanted to give them some more experience with all of that. We um, actually brainstormed during class and we just made a list of all the different questions that they would like to ask um, of each one. The, um, resource officer and the police chief. And then um, I just picked some, some students. I have a, a wheel, and so I put a name wheel and I spun the wheel and then they were able to raise their hand and ask the questions. We had them written on index cards. So they read their questions off their index cards in class um, to be able to find out more about each one of those workers. So oh, they absolutely love it. And they're, they ask questions all the time. They still had more questions. They didn't want them to leave. Um, so they kept wanting to ask more and more questions. And I think it's just really nice for them to be able to develop a relationship with our community workers and to be able to know that they're here to help them um, and to be there for them when they need them in cases of emergency. Um, and so I think creating that bond now is a good thing. Um, and I think that they really enjoy it. And you can see, um, you know, as you're going around and looking at them, their faces, they're smiling, they're interacting, and I, I really think that they take a lot away from this. My favorite thing was that I got to see a fire truck in person because I haven't seen it in like close up before. I just never met any firefighters before and I really liked um, this. My favorite thing was uh, going to the fire truck because I never seen one up close. Uh, I actually learned that they don't have dogs because I also thought they have dogs. <laughs>